BLM encourages violence. They encourage attacks and they tie the hands of citizens who want to do something about it. You are not allowed to intervene or they'll put you in jail. They'll indict you for whatever happens in the struggle. So you have no win here. You got a BLMer on a subway screaming, yelling, I'm going to kill you. If he hits you with a uh, you know, screwdriver, you could die. Or if you happen to get the better of him and choke him and he passes out because he's on too much George Floyd Fenty and goes down, you go to jail for life too. So it's a lose-lose situation in every major city. Take a look at how they're acting on the subway now that they know that you and I can't do anything about it. And everyone's just laughing about it, filming it, giggling. Nobody says, hey man, nobody pointed to the victim and said, that's the guy. He come out of a deep slumber wondering who just body slammed his neck while sleeping. And, uh, and everyone is quiet because BLM also teaches stop snitching, don't be a good citizen, this country is racist, white people are horrible, and so no one's gonna tell on the black guy. Take a look again, because if you blinked, you missed it. <laughs> So that is what every major city in America wants to bring to you next if you keep voting with your heart and for Democrats.